Go to Machine Setup and Coat Prime menu. Turn vacuum on and place a lens on the suction cup above coating bowl. With a clean container under the filter, remove the bleeder cap on the bottom of the filter. Turn the coating pump on using the touch screen. Once reservoir is empty, turn coating pump off and remove the top bleeder cap to drain remaining liquid and filter. Remove the nut on bottom of filter to release the tube. Pour acetone in the coating bowl and turn the pump on making sure to aim the disconnected tube into waste container. Disconnect the tube on the bottom of the reservoir. Unplug the level indicator. Remove the reservoir assembly. Remove filter from reservoir assembly. Remove elbow from filter to reuse on new one. Clean the reservoir with acetone and dry. Take the new coating filter and wrap the threads with Teflon tape, making sure not to put tape too close to the ends. Thread the new filter back onto the reservoir and put the elbow back on the bottom of the filter. Note that the flow arrow on the filter should be facing up. Reassemble reservoir into coating bowl. Reconnect coating tubes and level indicator. Clean coating bowl and allow to dry, then replace the screen.